politics, political sides, where we would like to study about the political sides as a subject of study in our plus two or our degree or as a specialization in our post graduation courses. Let us try to understand the meaning and also the origin of the word politics as well as the scope of politics. Where we would like to know the origin and meaning of politics. Politics is a Greek word, politica. The Greek word is politica. Politica means affairs of the cities. The first, the Greek cities started the civic life and with that the word politics, politica has become very famous with Aristotle using this word for the first time. Politics is the set of activities that are associated with making nations, groups or other forms of power relations among individuals such as the distribution of resources or status. The, it is a, it's a branch of social science, political science is a branch of social science and in this branch of social science, especially this political science and politics, it studies about the politics and government. The word politics emerged as a political science. Science means it is a systematic study. The study of political politics is nothing but a systematic study. How the government and all the other forms of power work together. And to be frank and also to be very analytical, when you see the scope, history is closely linked to politics and politics and history, they are, they interplay with each other, they support each other, they are dependent on each other, they are interrelated subjects because John C. Ray, he said that one, political science is close to the history because as per Sir John Seeley, politics without history has no root and that history without politics has no fruit because present politics is future history and past history, past politics is present history. The connection between economics and politics is if anything more intimate also. And in this way, political science and politics, they are part of social sciences. That means political science deals its ambitions, aspirations, formulations, functioning and the performance of politics is completely in social sciences. So social sciences is the most important foundations for the emergence of politics. For example, politics is very close to economics. Politics is very close to society that is sociology. And of course, it is the politics which is most important in public administration. One is political power, the other one is the administrative power. There is a foreplay, there is a power play between these two.
public administration and economics. And the whole activity of the human life is concentration of economics, finances. So this way, now a kind of social politics is going on, what they call it welfare politics. The welfare schemes and all that one, they are one side to the politics, the other side to the economics and the other side we find it strongly entrenched to the society. So when we look into the social sciences, when we look into the political sciences, we find that one, all the subjects are closely interrelated. Because in our previous topics and all that we discussed about, when we were talking about interrelation, international relations, we were talking about geopolitics. So geography and politics, the physical features, the political features, the political boundaries, everything has to do lots with political affairs. So this way you find that one, geography and politics. Geography population geography. So, sociology and politics, economics and politics, politics and public administration, politics and history. Because when we want to do something, we should know about our past. For example, today the laws they are bringing some changes, then they have to go into the old ways of doing things. Everything is nothing but a simple change over the past. So unless you know the past, you can't plan your political agendas, political schemes and also the improvement of political situations. So this way, all these subjects are interrelated and they are interconnected and they strongly influence each other in this way. Politics, political science, they have very wider ramifications. When we come to the meaning of politics, generally the acceptable and the visible and the current politics is nothing but sharing and shaping of power because the people with the political ambitions to gain power they enter into politics and it is the political field. So this way we find that one, there is lots of things, lots of things we, should, we will do. And the politics they do with, with in the Indian democratic country with electoral politics, managerial politics, in the career development, in the corporate world where we see there is political administration and once upon a time administration was a part of politics and later there was politics, public administration, dichotomy. That means both were separated from each other as independent study but in practice they are interdependent. They, there is a foreplay interplay, internal relations because here we find that one, the political boss is the head of the framework of the administration. So this way we find that one politics and public administration and also politics and economics. And we know that one Janikya, he wrote Arthasastra and Arthasastra the most important principle is how to develop the society and how to enrich the people, how to make people wealthy, how to make economic prosperity, then only how the ruler, the emperor, the king 
कैन सर्वाइव एंड ही कैन विन दी हार्ट ऑफ द पीपल दैट्स वॉट अर्थशास्त्र सो एदर इन स्टेट पॉलिटिक्स सेंट्रल पॉलिटिक्स और फैमिली अफेयर्स इन सोसाइटी वी फाइंड दैट वन पॉलिटिक्स प्लेस वेरी वेरी very very important role this way the the scope of politi- political political science is very widespread and political science when we want to read different theories of administration the theories of political systems political parties how they function its ethical moral issues the importance of politics and how life is mostly influenced by political developments all this we are going to read in detail at length and if someone says that one we are nothing to do with the politics it is ample true that ambitions are very common and when we try to get one kind of upper hand you want to get a kind of control we want to get a leverage automatically there starts politics where there is more than one person there starts politics and it is very often said that one our cup of coffee starts with international politics because coffee brazil is the coffee pot of the world cuba is the sugar bowl of the world and european countries they are those are the milk centers so all this mixed together it becomes coffee so our morning bed coffee our morning bed tea starts with international politics and you see in many places and all that one street politics is very very common nowadays and for example narendra modi ji has chosen chai ka charcha chai ka chai pai charcha program to influence the common man and he was successful to influence the thoughts of the people and become a role model a trend setter in the indian political system and wherever you find rallies dharnas hartals are made to influence the public opinion so public opinion pressure groups political parties and all these the, all these most important play very important role in the system of uh, politics so we are going to read in detail about so many other things related to politics and in civil services in the group examinations in the interviews as well as in the current topics and also when we as a subject of study as a branch of study as your specialization or your phd whatever you see you find politics is most important subject because it will be touching every aspect of the political scenario in your society in the region at the state national and international so political science has wider ramifications and we are going to read in detail thank you very much